Hello everyone! Yes, with the XPIC you can also do this wonderful thing. There is no longer a need to turn the knobs on the guitar or buy pedals for the volume to create a magnificent fade-in in the notes or chords. To activate this feature, just set any compressor in this way. Raise the sensitivity, completely lower the attack, raise the output. You can manage it according to your test preferences. All compressors, both virtual and physical, are equipped with a regulator for the attack, so it will be easy for you to obtain excellent results by simply excluding it. Obviously, if you turn up the volume of the compressor a lot, we recommend that you lower the overall volume directly from the amp. As for the strumming, it's exactly the same speech we did in the tutorial for the delay. There is, use the X pick near the pickup, both with the chords and in solos, and you can activate or deactivate these techniques simply by moving on the strings. This time, if you want more interaction, you can also use it exactly above the pickup. Also remember that each pickup has its own polarity, so depending on the pickup you are playing on, you have to find the right direction of the X pick to interact with, because each side has a different polarity. Guys, with the X pick you can also do things that cannot be done simply by knobs or volume pedals. For example, the auto volume swell effect at high speed. This technique is made exclusively with a special pedal with a microprocessor, like this, the Vongon, costing $3000. With the x pick the microprocessor, it's you. Watch this! This is the value of this single technique. Not to mention the fact that no knobs, no pedal and no microprocessor give you total control over the pattern, volume and the length of the fade-in in real time. How about, is that enough for just one XPIC technique? Greetings to all, the XPIC staff!